Well, our state's water dilemmas haven't dried out just yet. In fact, to respond, the Southern Nevada Water Authority could be receiving even more authority. That's to limit water use if this assembly bill is passed this legislative session. Ryan Matthew joining us live from the newsroom with the potential here, Ryan. Yeah, David Denise, currently other lawmakers need to approve any cuts to how much water you're allowed to use, but AB 220, if passed, could make Nevada one of the only states to give that sweeping power to its water authority. And this comes as Lake Mead continues to see record low levels. Almost our, all of our water comes from there, actually. This bill would allow the water authority to limit residential water usage during a declared shortage, and we've been under a federally declared shortage since 2021. The limit would be just slightly more than what the average household uses at about 160,000 gallons a year, but some of the largest offenders here use over 70 times that. In the big picture, AB 220, uh, wants to give uh, seeks to give the the water authority and our local governments the flexibility they need to respond quickly if uh, the situation on uh, in the Colorado River system declines. Now the bill would also prohibit the use of Colorado River water on non-functional turf. There are a few exceptions to that though. Businesses would also need to get permission if they want to put grass on their property. And today was just the first hearing on this item and it could be a long road ahead before any action is actually taken on this. David. Right, thank you. And the bill goes even further to require many homes using wells to connect to the sewer system in 30 years. If you keep a track, that is in 2054.